Hello there, and welcome to Matchlock Studios, and today we're having a look at this, the Marlboro at Blenheim Ballista Pack from Warlord Games, for the Black Powder range. This is a 28mm figure, well there's more than one figure in here, let's just open it up and see what we get. So, thank you to Chuck for uh, packaging this one, thank you very much. We have our foam, traditional foam, and we have the minis. So I should put them all out here, and we'll go through them one at a time. So the set contains four uh, figures, uh, five including the horse. So let's just start with the horse. It's a very nice, whoop, solid white metal miniatures. Very nicely detailed, with the bridle, all the details on the saddle work as well. Very nice, very solid little figure. When we have John Churchill, uh, Duke of Marlborough, very nicely done, and he sits upon the horse like so. I'll just get this nicely positioned. Ooh. So yes, very nicely done. And there is actually, uh, it's more like a little diorama scene, this, and I'll explain what's happening when I... Uh, Sort of put it together, um, or loosely put it together. Here we have looks like a servant holding or just a, holding on to the side of the bride there. But again, very nicely done. Detail on them is absolutely stunning, especially the facial features. Look at that, very nice. Here we have another. Servant or auditory with the kettle drum. Now he's holding it up. Now the reason he's holding it up is so it goes like so. Is it uh, after the Battle of Blenheim? Um, it was sort of a uh, Duke of was in the saddle for nearly 12 to 15, uh, 10 to 15 hours, something like that, and he didn't want, couldn't dismount. And the reason he couldn't dismount is because if he thought he dismounted, he would, um, wouldn't be able to mount his horse. You never imagine if you've been in the saddle for so long, you will have a very, very numb bum. And so, one of his orderlies holds up a drum so he could write a message to the Queen, Queen Anne, to say that the battle had been won. And all he had to write on was a bill from the local tavern from the night before, which I believe was for it was either half a chicken or a pie, two flagons of ale, and three candles. And that was his bill. And the only thing he had the receipt to write on. And here we have a nice little miniature here, who's collected some captured French colours, and he's positioned about there. Now, all of this little diorama is taken from a fantastic painting, and uh, hopefully if... Using magic works that will be up in front of you now. So it's taken from this image here of if you can see obviously there all around and it's a stunning little kit. So as you can see here, it's nicely laid out, fantastic figures, and I can't wait to have these based up for Duke of Marlborough to be commanding the British and Allied forces during the battle itself. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little video, guys. A uh, nice look at the Ballista Pack uh, from Warlord Games. Check their website out. They're really cool. Uh, lots more other stuff coming up. So, uh, don't forget, guys, to uh, hit that subscribe button down here. I'll follow and like subscribe button. And check out any of our latest videos as well over this side. All further ado, guys, take care and uh, stay safe out there.